Okay, in this problem, we're told that Mrs. Chen owns two pieces of property, and the areas of the properties are 77,120 square feet and 33,500 square feet. And here they give you the conversion from feet, square feet to acres. 43,560 square feet is one acre. Find the total number of acres she owns, Mrs. Chen owns, to the nearest hundredth of an acre. So, What's the idea? Well, the idea is that you have these two properties, one's larger than the other, right? 77,120 square feet, or feet squared, that's some large property here, and then this smaller property over here, right, the 33,500 square feet, and we're putting them together, and we want to know what is this total, right, what is the total acreage between these two properties? So all we really have to do is, this is a, a portion, if you think um, of a ratio of a, or a proportion, you can think, well, our total here is 77,120 plus the other piece of land, 33,500, out of what? Well, we want to know here, you can think of it out of or, or how many times does 43,560 square feet go into that? Because that'll be how many acres we have, right? If you want to think about it on a, on a simpler level, let's say we have um, a, a different conversion here where in this other place, let's say 10 square feet, right, equals one acre. Let's just pretend that for a moment. Well, if you had, if you had a property with 20 square feet, how many acres would you have? Well, if 10 square feet is one acre, 20 square feet would be double that or two acres, right? And if you had... 100 square feet then, how many acres would you have? Well, if each 10 square feet is one acre, you would divide 100 square feet by 10, and that's equal to 10, so that would be 10 acres in this, with these made up uh, ratios here. Um, because essentially you're, you're, you're finding out how many times, right, one acre goes into the amount of total acreage you have, or in, in terms of feet, how many square feet Right, groups of, groups of 10 square feet go into 100. Now that's the same thing down here, except the numbers aren't as friendly. So what I would do is just add up these two, right? 77,120 plus 33,500. Enter and then divide, press the divide button, by 43,560. And that's our answer, except they want to the nearest hundredth. So the 5.5 is tenths. 0 0.03, this 3 here is hundredths, so we round that 3 up because the 9 over here in the thousandth place is, a, is in the 5 or above range, so you round up when your digit to the right of whatever you're rounding is 5 or above. So we get 2, right, 0.54 acres. Now I, I hope I didn't botch this up by over explaining it, sometimes I'll talk myself into a circle. Um, but anyway, the idea is you're finding the total acreage um, by adding the total square feet and then dividing by the unit rate, which is the number of square feet in one acre. Thanks.